Hey everybody, welcome. My name is Drew Hollis here with Akai Professional to give you a first peek at the MPC Live. Now this is our one of two of our brand new MPCs in the newest generation. These are completely standalone now. We've gone back to roots, listened to all the customer feedback, and we wanted to make sure we are listening to you guys and giving you what you really want. So what this is, is uh, the same layout actually as our MPC Touch that is currently on the market, but this one is completely standalone and the kicker, it's actually battery powered. So not only standalone, but you can bring this with you wherever you go. This is truly an MPC that isn't for any one style of music or any one genre. It's actually meant for everybody. So what we went and did was we built a custom OS right from the scratch in here. It's a 1.8 gigahertz quad core processor, two gigs of RAM. You have 16 gigs of onboard memory. And basically 10 of those gigs are gonna give you all of the legacy sounds from every MPC in history. You have six additional gigs to add your own content on, but we wanna make sure it's expandable. So not only do you have that amount of space on here, but you can expand it with your own SATA drive as well. We have USB ports on the back here, so you can use a thumb drive or another external drive and really go to town on however you want to store and move your stuff around. SD card slot as well, and it's fully media uh, ready for pretty much any MPC format you have previously, you can load up on here with no problems. So a quick tour of the hardware up top, we have our uh, iconic MPC style pads here that are four by four in a 16 layout. You have eight banks of these pads and all your MPC tools are at your fingertips. Right in the center here, we have a gorgeous seven inch full touch screen with 10 points of touch. And this will allow you to really get around to any part of the MPC you want at any point. So right here on my main menu, I have all my basic track information, what uh, drum program I'm on and et cetera. But if I move on to my menu, I have easy access to my sampler. If I want to sample in the back of here using my built-in inputs and outputs, I can go to uh, my sample edit and actually use my touch screen to go down and actually edit all the way down to the sample level if I really want to. So this touch screen we spent a lot of time on. We want to make sure it lives up to your expectations on what a touch screen can do. So uh, back to the pads and using that with the touch screen, I can do things like XY effects, which is really great. What I can actually do is use my drum pads to drop in a filter and actually use my touch screen to affect filter sweeps and a bunch of different things. Really the sky's the limit. So beyond my filter sweeps on XYFX and all of those things that I can do, um, I also have access to all my transport controls right at my fingertips down the bottom. So you don't have to go menu diving for just about anything on this unit. Everything is just about one or two clicks away. I have my Q-Link knobs on the right and my main data wheel that I can use to manipulate whatever current thing I'm highlighted on here. And it's completely portable, like I said, so you can take this wherever you go, no power required. My USB port on the back here will support any kind of USB class compliant audio device or MIDI controller. And this is the MPC Live. If you guys have more questions, please contact your Full Compass sales professional or go to fullcompass.com. Thanks.